and Dean Chatton, winemaker for Geyser Peak Winery. Today I'm going to take you through your next club shipment of wines. We'll start with the 2009 Waterbend Chardonnay. Waterbend takes its name both from the waterbent barrels that we use in the winemaking process, as well as a large bend in the Russian River where we source most of the fruit for this wine. That comes from our Essentia Estate Vineyard located about two miles north of the winery. Now Chardonnay always has an incredible golden color, but particularly here in the Alexander Valley, there's a slight green hue to the wine as well, which makes it look as appetizing as it tastes. The nose opens with baked apple, a little bit of a hint of citrus, and some incredible creme brulee and caramel notes. On the palate, it leads to more of a roasted hazelnut type character and a bit of creamy nuttiness that comes from the yeast leaves that we stir into the wine over the course of the wine's maturation. This is one of my favorite wines paired with gougeres, which are tiny bread puffs which are one of my favorites of the holiday season. Our next wine is the 2007 Reserve Cabernet. Our Reserve Cabernet is well known for being a big structured full-bodied wine that delivers in-your-face power and chewy tannins. 2007 was no exception. We have another fantastic vintage of this wine. It will be a perfect match for the holiday season. The tannins do give this wine longevity, which means you can tuck it away in your cellar for several years for optimal enjoyment. But because it is drinking so nicely right now, if you decant this wine, it will be a fabulous accompaniment to traditional holiday fare. The beautiful garnet color leads to aromatics of vanilla, a little bit of spice, cassis, and blackberry. And on the palate, we get this rich textural component that lasts and lingers on the palate well after you swallow the wine. As I mentioned, it'll make a great pairing for holiday fare. I particularly like this with anything that has a little bit of spice in it. Uh, perhaps something with a bit of cardamom or cinnamon in it will make a nice pairing for this wine. Our next wine is the 2008 J&J Fay Block Collection Merlot. This is a wine that we produce in very small quantities just for our wine club members. The 2008 was a lovely vintage and delivered fruit that, while intense, is a little bit softer and rounder on the palate and makes it a great sipping wine, as well as a wine that will go well with a number of different foods. If you're looking for a red wine to enjoy before the meal, this is the go-to wine. The tannins are soft and supple, there's raspberry and cherry fruit on the palate with little hints of vanilla and spice. I would particularly enjoy this wine paired with something braised or glazed, perhaps with a little bit of sweetness to complement some of the rounder, fuller tannins. Thank you for joining me to taste through these wines. I wish everyone a happy holiday season. I hope you enjoy the wines, and we'd love to hear your feedback, either through our website or through visiting our tasting room. Again, thank you for your time, and enjoy the wines. We'll see you next year.